What is this? A human having trespassed onto my realm. Hmm. The poor thing looks like she's collapsed. Barely dressed appropriately enough for this kind of cold. What are you doing here? What could have possessed you to come up into these frozen mountains all alone? And hardly prepared. Hmm. Perhaps I shall bring you back to my palace. I have questions. You do make me curious. Ah, coming around now, I see. Do not be afraid. You are safe here. My name is Ira, Fae King of Ice and Snow, and all things cold. And you are in my palace at the moment. I have taken the liberty of providing you a fire in the hearth. I do not usually require warmth. Now then, if you are comfortable enough, I have some questions I would like to ask you. You do not look as though you were prepared for a track up into frozen mountains, quite treacherous for humans. So, what is your purpose here? What are you doing in my domain? You are running away from what? Do not clam up now. Do I look like I am going to go running to whatever human source of your problems may be? Trust me, I have no desire to associate with mortals any more than I am right now. This is plenty enough for me. Now, kindly answer my question. Hmm. You say your family was murdered by the local land baron. 
you wanted your family's farmlands and your father would not sell. You escaped and you were pursued. But they did not dare follow you as you fled into the mountains. <laughs> this does not surprise me. Most of the aristocracy knows quite well. I do not tolerate mortals seeking personal gain in my territory. I owe them nothing. And rightfully, they fear me. So, what now shall I do with you? What is that? I have yet to even ask you your name. Hm. True enough, I suppose. Well then, what is your name? Hmm. A pleasant enough name for a mortal. <laughs> you are quite lovely as well. Now that you are getting warmed up. And color returns to your flesh. Hmm. Perhaps... If the mortal were, is presently proving too dangerous for you, you might choose to remain here and keep a lonely Fae King company. Like I said, I have no desire to venture forth into the world of humans. Far too much greed and corruption. I could seek companionship among my fellow Fae. But I often find much of the same. Hence my isolation in my frozen little paradise. <laughs> so, what say you? Be a companion. To the Snow King. I can cast a charm upon your body to protect you from the cold. You will feel it no more than I. <laughs> you are an interesting one. Of course you have a choice. You simply have slim options, I think. Where will you go? The minute you attempt to leave these mountains, no doubt that Sleazy land baron, Victor Vycroft, 
has spies watching and waiting for you. You are a threat to him after all. You have a right to claim the land that he stole from your father. How do I know that the Baron has already claimed it? <laughs> because I know people like him. Advantage. Seizing. Slugs that they are. Preying upon the weak. At every opportunity. Though. I cannot say that. I have not done so myself. From time to time. Though I. <laughs> I can honestly say that it was for. A far less selfish reasoning. What will you do here? You wish to know what will be expected of you. <laughs> I can see the look in your eyes. You need not worry about intimacy, at least not for a while. For now, while we get to know each other, you will accompany me on walks through my territory. Enjoy my meals with me. You will accompany me in my study while I work. Perhaps you might even help me catalog a few things. Pour me my wine. And in return, I will see to your every comfort and happiness. Whatever you might need, I can provide. The powers of a fay are quite limitless. If I wanted, I could have imposed upon you by now to do my will. But I am not, and I will not. I find that a Willing companion is far more enjoyable. Having someone hate you at the back of their minds is hardly a comfort to stab off the loneliness. You seem surprised that a cold and frozen bay like myself would get lonely. But I do. The truth is, as much as some would like to deny it, we all do. 
companionship is a necessity for the soul. <laughs> of course, they have souls. My goodness. It is hardly exclusively for mortals. Now then, your answer, please. You will do so. Excellent. Then you will live here with me in my palace. I will see to every comfort and need that you have. And I will protect you from your enemies. Should that land baron seek to find you here, I will freeze him to the very pits of his dark, black little heart. Now then, welcome home, my dear.